Hi, everyone. I am delighted to join the National Gallery of Art in celebrating the one and only Alma Thomas. Her works are often starbursts on canvas. Alma Thomas, the first fine arts graduate of Howard University. She is now recognized as a major American painter of the 20th century. She found her signature style as an artist at 75 years old, inspired by the light and colors of the flowers of D.C. She is the first African-American woman to have her work purchased or acquired by the White House collection. The Obamas put her painting, Resurrection, in the White House Old Family Dining Room. And now, beginning this month into next year, there's a sweeping effort across D.C. to showcase her work. The Phillips Collection, Howard University, American University, all of us are, are really kind of coming in this conversation together. It really is about what Alma has done for the city and her legacy as an artist. Damon Reeves is head of education at the National Gallery of Art, where the former first lady kicked off celebrations. And we asked, what exactly makes an Alma Thomas? I think she was best known for, for pieces like the one behind me. It's bright, it's colorful, it's a distraction. Um, a lot of, lot of great energy and, and just really sort of bright and full of life. She paved the way for black artists to paint differently within the abstract movement. And now, on what would have been her 130th birthday, a thank you from her hometown. At the National Gallery of Art, Mike Valerio, WUSA 9.